Hey fans, and welcome into today's Coach's Corner. We have Everblades coach Brad Ralph here joining us from the road. And coach, last night a two to one overtime loss against the Greenville Swamp Rabbits uh, in front of a, a packed crowd at Hertz Arena. Just first of all, what was it like, you know, coaching in front of that uh, of that crowd, the biggest of the season by far so far? Yeah, Mike, it was amazing. Uh, just you know how far we've come since you know COVID has hit, and now. Um, to see all those those people supporting our team and just coming out and enjoying, uh, you know, a sporting event, I thought was was just amazing. It was great energy, and and we certainly we gave it everything we had to to send them home happy. It was a two to one overtime loss. You guys outshot Greenville by a wide margin, thirty seven to 20, 23. How did you feel that your team performed overall? Yeah, you know, I thought we played really well. Uh, I thought the guys worked extremely hard. We we you know, we possessed the puck a lot. I thought we carried the play. Um, like you said, we we heavily outshot them. Um, unfortunately, you know, we weren't putting pucks in the net. I think you know, we just, we we've got to generate maybe some higher percentage scoring chances. I think Greenville defends really well, um, and we just need some guys to to connect. I thought we had chances certainly in the third period to put that game away, and we weren't able to. Um, but you know, unfortunately, it was another heartbreaking loss for for our group. I think we've had a number of those here lately. So um, certainly in hockey, um, you know, we're managing the game well. We're managing the referees well. Uh, I think we're tightening up our game both, you know, defensively and at the blue line. So a lot of positives to take from it. Um, it just would have been nice to get that win. Now, tonight, you guys are in Orlando. It's a chance to take home the Brabham Cup. That would be the second of your tenure here with the Everblades. You also uh, got one a couple of years ago in that 2017-2018 team. Uh, what would that hardware mean to this group? You know, it, it's, it's such a long season. I think if there's any positives, if there's any rewards or successes that come through it, the course of the season, I think it's, um, you know, it's, it's well-earned and it's deserved. So I, I'm really hopeful we can get the job done tonight because I believe this group certainly deserved it. Um, it would have been nice to get it done last night and take a little bit of the pressure off, but we don't seem to do anything easy these days. Um, you know, and, and all that being said, we're, we're starting playoffs in two days. So we have to, you know, while we want to win first place in the league and tonight's important to us, we also have to look forward to Monday and make sure that we're, we're ready for playoffs. So it's, it's, uh, it's been a, it's been a tough last two months and, you know, we haven't done ourselves any favors. And um, so tonight it's just about going out, playing solid hockey, finding a way to get a win, but also we need to, um, you know, manage some minutes and make sure that these guys are energized and have their legs come Monday. You mentioned the date with the South Carolina Stingrays in the first round of the playoffs coming up. Uh, this next Monday, of course, want to make sure everybody's healthy. We saw Kyle Newber take a, a puck to the mouth last night. He ended up coming back onto the ice. But uh, aside from that, what can we look for out of the Blades uh, here tonight? And a group that's undergone some injuries throughout the season. Yeah, it's uh, it's been an injury plate season for us, especially, you know, especially the second half. Um, so, but but that's. That's what happens. You know, you've got to get on a deep playoff run and hopefully guys can, um, you know, come back from injuries at that point. So, yeah, I was unfortunate to see Kyle take that puck to the face last night. I, I think he'll be okay. He certainly, um, you know, had some stitches and damaged some teeth. So, um, unfortunate for him. So, yeah, you know, we're going to, again, try and get some guys healthy. I'm sure we're going to have some guys that won't be playing due to injury um, for, for game one come playoffs. But, you know, that's that's hockey. We have other guys. We have a deep hockey team. We have other guys that, that will need to step up. All right. Thanks, Coach. Good luck tonight. Thanks, Mike. All right. That was Everblades head coach Brad Ralph on today's Coach's Corner.